Hey, I wanted to make a quick video uh, going through the Ninja Trader platform. Just downloaded it today, and I've been uh, experimenting with a couple things to see how we'd use it as far as spike trading. Uh, Infinity is still fine, but I'm looking at uh, trying to find other brokers that'll give us better execution. And one of the other individuals that I trade with has been having a terrible time with Infinity, so I'm trying to find something now just in case the time comes when I have to leave. As far as brokers go, I found Global Futures. As you can see here, where is it? Uh, Three hundred dollar day trading margin for all of the E minis, which include the S and P, Nasdaq, and the Dow. And for the thirty year U S T bonds, the Z B, their uh, margin is five hundred, which is very good. Actually, better than Infinities as far as the uh, E minis goes. But the if you want to open up an account, the minimum is five hundred dollars. So it's also very cheap to get involved with this company. Um, also note that they do have live chat. And this has also been very helpful. As you can see here. You know you can just click on what you need. They also offer Forex and several other uh, things as well. One of the main things I like about this company is they have 24 hour customer support. Which is a beautiful thing. Because a lot of the companies don't offer that. Including Infinity. Alright, but back to the actual platform. As you can see here, when you first download it, Global Futures will actually help out with and they'll set up your entire platform, which they did for me. But once you uh, log on, this is the screen you're going to get initially. Alright, all you do is come in, click on New, you click on Static Superdome, and that's how you get this uh, item right here and then over here you're able to pretty much pick anything that you want as far as which instrument you're going to want to trade alright and if you want to add new instruments just go to tools instrument manager and that brings up everything here as you can see they pretty much have anything you would want to add or trade you can also search by typing in the name here or the symbol see ZB 30 year US Treasury bonds there alright one of the main things I like about the platform itself is when you enter a trade let's say we're gonna enter a market buy order it'll show up exactly at the price on the chart so market buy order filled. and you see right there I'm in the market at that particular price and I can also alter let me exit out of this Boy order filled <clears throat> Give me one second, I want to set something up here real quick so you guys can see the different uh, methods to do this. Say I have three profit targets, change that to one for each. Stop loss is going to be five for each. And we'll set the profit targets up a couple points away from each other. All right. Now let's say I place a buy order here. Board order filled. There it is. You can actually see right on the chart and also on the uh, Superdome everything. And this is a, a great feature that I'm not used to, but I, I do like this a lot. And one of the other things I like is that you can actually manipulate your chart. So if you're in a trade and you want to manipulate your uh, exit orders or your profit targets, you can just move them down as such and it also does it over here in the uh, Superdome so yeah it's that simple you can do the same thing with your um, stop order where you want to get out of the market let me just close everything and to close everything you just click close it cancels all your orders target and it was that quick alright let me see what I want to show you guys now um, for secret news weapon elite as you can see up here we have the buy and sell buttons for this platform it will simply click those buttons so if we wanted to set this up we could use a test here we'll go ahead and do a test execute I've already set my buttons up order filled. and there it is and as you just saw the order was filled alright order filled 
Let me exit out of that. Let me set this up so you guys can see that it will uh, go ahead and place your target and stop losses. One second. All right, so this is going to be set to one on a quantity target. Okay, so it should be set now. All right, now I'm going to press execute again. Board order filled. And there it is. Actually, it didn't enter my uh, targets here, which is interesting. I'm not sure why it didn't enter my targets. Most likely because I didn't uh, trigger it over here on, on the uh, dome. I wonder if I can use these buttons to enter the market. I'm going to test that now. Hyperclick setup. Let's see if we can set this up here like this. By and sell alright let's try this again board order filled alright so there you have it you can actually do it that way and that will go ahead and import your uh, trailing stop if you want to set that up or just your set stop with a set target and I mean that's it's pretty simple it's about as simple as you can make it and again once you're in your trade all you have to do is just move your uh, exit or stop order to where you want it to be you can also alter like I said before your um, exit so this is just some interesting stuff for you guys to watch or play around with after you actually get into it <clears throat> Let me see here. Order pending. And that's how you place a limit. You can just click on the market. Order pending. I'm gonna go ahead and exit out of this. Target filled. Alright, if you want to place a sell on a stop or a buy on a stop, for example, let's say I want to place a buy on a stop here. You actually have to place your uh, middle mouse button, that little rolling key that a lot of mouse uh, mouses have. You press it, you get that, and you just click this little uh, check right here. Order pending. And that's the buying a stop. All right. And of course, you can move it. And for the one closes other, let me see here. I believe you right click in this area here. It is here. Where is it at? OCO orders. So you click that. Order canceled. And that will uh do a OCO order on anything order pending alright and then here it is here again and you just basically set it up that way order cancelled I'm not exactly sure how to set up the brackets yet I haven't gone that deep into it but just wanted to do a quick overview so you guys can see that it is possible number one to use secret news weapon elite and number two, that it is possible also with Ninja Trader to manage things directly from the charts, which is a a great thing, I think. And then you can see over here, you know, you have a log which will show everything that you've done, similar to MetaTrader, which I also thought was great. So I'm actually going to start testing this in the future, and we will basically see how it goes. I want to see since it's only five hundred dollars to open up a live account I most likely will uh, at some point going ahead and open up a live account just so we can see how the fills are I spoke to another individual that's doing something similar to what I'm doing as far as uh, trading the news and he's getting excellent fills with ninja trader and I'm not sure why you know cuz ninja trader and uh, infinity should both be entering you know similar but he's getting great fills so I'm gonna see if uh that'll happen with me as well over the next couple weeks you guys will see um, 10 trades I'm gonna do 10 trades before I open up a live account no screw that Let, let's make it five trades we'll do five trades before I go live and we'll see how everything goes from there and uh, hopefully things will continue to go well and I'll see you guys on the next live or excuse me on the next uh, test trade that I do with uh, ninja trader thank you